Okay, I've logged into my Rally dashboard and I want to configure my IDE, uh, which is Eclipse, to use Rally so I can uh, access Rally from Eclipse and not have to go to the web page. First, I'll click on the link, which actually, let me see this. Uh, I'm using Eclipse 3.5, so I'm going to copy this link. I want to uh, add this as a URL to Eclipse. So if I close everything here and I go to install new software, I'm going to um, add a site if I haven't, although um, this actually should have already been added um, right here. I've added the URL the update site which gives me the rally myelin connector you look at this it's really just one connector version 1.5.3 gonna hit I'm gonna go to install that plugin <coughs> and depending upon how fast your system is it'll download it accordingly And now I see that it has downloaded the my connector. Click next. I'd like to accept the agreement. Click finish. It's going to install the software or the plugin. And now you'll notice uh, you might get this uh, screen. Uh, uh, security warning saying it's unsigned content. I'm, you know, if you want to see the details, it just doesn't have signed jars. I'll hit OK. Now, of course, I'd like to restart so my plugin will take effect. Uh, start my workspace up and at this point um, I'll get, I'm going to go directly to my workbench you'll notice I have this rally dashboard now so if I click the dashboard what I'll notice I'll have a task repository and what I can do but on the dashboard I have a task repository but I actually am not connected to rally so what I will do is I'm going to click here create new query I'm going to create a rally I'm going to add a task repository, which is going to be a Rally repository. Click Next. Now I'm going to use the Rally 1 server. Um, I can call this anything I want. Um, I'll call this you know, X, XIVR for the project that I'm working at. I now put in my username that I log into the Rally website with. password. Um, I'd like to save my password that way I don't have to add it in multiple times. Validate my account and it's authenticated my credentials. So now I don't have a lot of other options that I can use excluding the editor itself and what it's telling me is my repository already exists so if I can actually cancel that cancel this and I can refresh oh, reset. Now after we've configured our repository if it wasn't configured already if you want to add a new query you should have already log it should already log you in and you should see a workspace and for me uh, Comcast is the workspace I'm using 
and what I'm interested in is my XIVR project. You should see all the different projects you're working on. And I hit finish, and it's as simple as that. Now if I have tasks um, that are coming in, I should be able to see them here. And that's it.